Ahoy there, YouTube! I'm back again today for another Kickstarter critique where I take a look at a different Kickstarter project every single time and give my honest thoughts on how that project is being ran. And today I'm very excited to be checking out the 17th most popular project on all of Kickstarter. That is the Fockeye 2 Work Smart with the most powerful productivity tech. Now before we get into this, I want to mention this is a kick booster product, which means there's a link down below. If you think that this product is something you can't live without, you go back and I get a small percentage of whatever you back. I think it's like 10%. Now, my track record with Kick Booster products is very, very rocky, and, uh, and you, if you've watched this channel, you know that doesn't really skew my grading scale. But anywho, I'm excited to check this one out because I don't actually know what it is. The Fockeye 2 works smart, and this really intrigued me because I looked at it, and I looked at the description, and I said, I don't know what this thing is. It's not how hard you work, a better productivity tool to power up your 2020. Uh, two. So it doesn't actually say what the thing is, but yet it's raised $143,000, it's in wearables, which I did not even know was a section on Kickstarter. That's kind of neat. Okay, there's two things. Uh, everything. Okay, there's only two. Okay. Uh, so as always, when we go into the video, I'm thinking three things. Oh, but the main... So here's my main issue that I have already. I don't know what you're selling me in. I don't know why I want this. And I feel like that's something that you should convey in the main description at some point. Now, that being said... Maybe there's something to be said at the fact that now people are intrigued to see what this thing is. Let me know what side of the fence you fall on that. If you see this, or have you seen this, were you more intrigued to check it out, or less intrigued by the fact you didn't actually know what it was based on the picture and description? But anywho, when we go into the video, think of three things. Do I want it? Can you do it? How much is it? Let's go. It's not how hard you work, it's the tool and skill you use to achieve more with less effort. Yet, procrastination steals your chance. What if you have a laser-sharp focus? Clip foci to your waist to power up. Read emotion records to find out how- Okay, I am very intrigued by what they're selling here. As someone who works from home and does Bowers Game Corner, I find myself you know, trying to stay on point. And so this is something that I, I, I personally would be very interested in this product. I also see their issue right now immediately of trying to, what do you say this product is? How do you advertise that just on your window, on your marquee, with your picture and your type description before they actually click on this? Uh, I'm going to think on that. But I, I do like what they're showing me here, but I think they're showing it to me too fast. Like, th this has only been 14 seconds, and I actually want to look at this. Deep focus, uh, my emotion records versus yesterday. Lots of fatigue during uh, lecture. Bring an espresso tomorrow. Emotion Got a little stressed by the to SI find out how well you do. Um, See, I couldn't even read that. Peak mental performance after coffee break. How, how would you know if I'm having peak mental performance? So I'm very curious. This is promising the world in the first 15 seconds. Um, I'm excited. You do. Earn awesome productivity reports when you work. Stay ahead. Get timely. So I'm going to guess this is based off your heart rate, your relaxed flow. So that's neat. You could actually see what settings, what situations, what people you were for focused on or less focused on when you're working. That actually sounds like a really cool idea. Everything they're pitching here I love so far. I just think they need to slow it down a bit. Stay ahead. Get timely distractions. Because I, 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 actually, I, should, I shouldn't assume that I'm going to have to pause to read all this. So we're just going to see if I can read all of it. Get timely distraction, distraction alert to stay alert, productive. Alert, Take the shortcut. I didn't even have time to read the four bullet points there, let alone the sentence underneath the bullet point, which I want to know. What are the settings? What are the features? These are the selling points of this item. And you're going through them so fast. I wonder if Jalop's in on this. Uh, Jalop is a company that people pay to to, to really uh, do a lot for the Kickstarter video, di various different product things. And uh, this is just going so fast. Five short vibrations when you form a fatigue streak. That sounds exciting. I don't even know what that is. Four short vibrations when you form a stress streak. Three short vibrations to preempt you from becoming distracted. That's actually really, really cool. Like, just like, ding, ding, ding. Oh, shoot. Okay. Yeah. Get back to work. Um, that's fantastic. Like, I love the idea behind this, but the only reason why I saw this really cool selling feature, which quite honestly, I think I would totally use the snot out of, was because I completely paused the video. One long vibration when you form a distraction sheet. I just think, slow it down. Take the shortcut. Upgrade your executive functions with the most advanced biofeedback training technology. What, what am I looking at? So it was going and I was like, what's this? Was self, my self-control per 10 minutes? I had 114 self... What does that mean? How does this work? This is... 
This is all fascinating, but I need to know more. Gain technology, gain the skills to tune out distraction, distraction, control procrastination, sustain longer focus and peak mental performance to give yourself the extraordinary edge in career and grades. Work smart. Okay. So, if I knew more about this product from the beginning, I think this is a spectacular video. But as someone who doesn't know anything... I thought it, it just bombarded me with information and I wanted to just slow down. Like if that would have been an extra 30 seconds, I think that could have been just an out of this world video. But as it stands now, I thought it was way too fast. Um, so also you promised the moon here. So I need to see a very good pedigree. I'm always a little bit skeptical when I try and tag a company on Twitter and they're not on there. You know, that's just one of those things. You know, if you click on somebody's Twitter, you see 15, 20,000. And yes, I know some companies could buy that. And I've seen people who buy that. And you, if you go actually look at some of these companies and start scrolling through all the people who follow them, like half of them are like Russian DJs. You're like, okay, this is getting a little... And not to diss on Russian DJs, but there's only a certain amount of Russian DJs in the world. And why are they following this vacuum cleaning company? It's all just super suspicious. Now, I'm not saying about them. I'm just saying... Whenever there's not a Twitter, I, I worry a little bit. So Tiny Logics. Also, I tried to Google some of the information on them, and I couldn't find that much social media wise. All models are wrong, but yours are stupid too. ML Hipster. We oppose illogically, philosophically, yet we do jump for joy over just one data point. We love models, designs, and products that are tidy and neat, yet we are so pious that science is the cure for everything else a human is just as complex as the world is we respect that and with that respect we the tiny logicians roll up our sleeves to solve problems that matter to you the only way we would ever know if we have done a good job or not is to hear from you look forward to hearing from you tiny logicians i i don't know if that was like the coolest or just the weirdest or what um I don't feel comfortable with your company based off of it, which I think is the main point of this little area. Like, hey, my name's Todd. I worked at Cambridge. I did this. I worked on Batman. What, 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 like, this is where you're supposed to say, oh, my God, our company has made this product X, Y, Z. Why you should feel comfortable. And they didn't do it. Now, Jalop, Kick Booster, Gadget Flow, Backer Club, Backer Crew, Tech I Want, Discover the Future. So pretty much what I'm seeing here is they put a lot of money into just marketing the snot out of this game and hoping that that was going to be uh, the big the big draw for this. And it worked for them. It really did. Like, this this is a successful formula. There are tons of people backing. I hope, I hope, I hope it works out for them. But let's go check out their four previous projects because they've created three other things. This is why we go here. Foci. So they did a Foci before. So this is the Foci 1 awesome so we got we can we can know right now pretty much how comfortable we're gonna feel so let's see the first foci make sure people liked it raised one hundred and sixteen thousand. fantastic mindful oh i hate this hate the fact that i can't see this that's always uh, okay cool so this is uh, why are no one's engaging in these in any way shape or form january 5th january 7th uh, December 31st. I can't see any of these. This is always a scary something to me. But you know what? You can't hide. You can't hide comments. Let's check out the comments. I prefer the offer from you. I received per mail. I already backed the Fockeye 1 and hope you will get me Fockeye 2 now. Uh, thank you for backing this again. So this is someone rebacking. I would like to back Fockeye 2, but what is the difference between Fockeye 1 and 2? I don't have any information on that. Uh, here's the Fockeye 2 link with the pictures and with the details. You've mentioned an update on Sunday for Android, but there is no update. So this looks great. I haven't received my product. So this is... Wow. Okay. Okay, my skepticism has been pushed to the side immediately with this one thing. And hopefully they spotlight the Fockeye 1 and the great success of the Fockeye 1. Because this is not a flaming dumpster fire in the comments. I was a little bit nervous, but that's what's going to happen. And it's not. It's people... It, okay, great. Excellent, excellent. Let's go check out the memo box. Make sure that's rocking and rolling good. But granted, honestly, the Fockeye, that's the one that I was... This looks bad. That always looks bad. Never received... Uh, one year ago, they did not comment. Hey, thank you so much for checking in. Never received status check. Just PM to delivery status. So do go check out JC. Get JC taken care of. Hi, Craig. Apologies for the late reply. Your reward has been sent in early January. So they do have some great customer service here. Can we get an update on the shipping? So here's what I'm seeing. I'm seeing some people having issues. Hey, where are the seven days at? Can you send me the seven day set with the base that's tight? I also haven't received a seven day set. Where's my seven day set? 
So we keep going down. Okay, now we're starting to see. Now my box died completely. It doesn't beep anymore. It doesn't charge. My box were quite fine at first, but now the app says player power too low. I'm still waiting for my seven-day set to. Huh, you promised an update on the seven-day set. Interesting. So that is definitely the kind of thing that we want to be a little bit concerned about. Okay. Yeah. So, 50-50 on that. Let's check out the original memo box. Make sure that wasn't a flaming dumpster fire. I'm going to guess the original memo box was not. Or else the, the memo box too, probably. Hey, my dad says he never received this item. Could you check and see if it was ever sent? You just kind of left Steve there. No, we cannot. What kind of battery? Uh, let's go down. I was well wondering if you could help me. I pledged for two of these. One doesn't connect to my, so this is someone having issues. I still have received my pledge. So, hi, I'm wondering if I could tell if I could pre-order some more. Okay. It doesn't look great, but it doesn't look terrible. So, it's it's an iffy track record on the can you do it. The thing that most convinced me was the the last one that you did looks solid, and I do want to do one more, like because I, I put my credibility on every grade I do. At least I try to. Uh, I want to go scroll down just a little bit lower on the comments. I just want to keep scrolling because twelve hundred comments is a lot, and sometimes companies will try to bury comments by posting a lot of things. I haven't received it. Okay, here we go. Uh, it's not working when unplugged from the wall. Is everything with my phone? It keeps saying that I feel calm when I feel my chest tight from anxiety. I've been using never received. Got my Foki, but it's not pairing. No tracking number. Oops, disregard comment. Never received. My battery device, uh, so it only goes to 64. Problems with the battery. Say something. What about the promise updates? Never received. Place to check by check bit. There's no new app version. So what I'm seeing here kind of and this is, and honestly, I know you might have been like, why are you going back into the comments section, Bauer? You just, I had a sneaking suspicion that if I went below the first chunk, we were going to find a lot of bad, because that's just what happens with Kick Booster products. And why? Why is it always Kick Booster? Why can't I ever do it? Why can't I give an A plus to a Kick Booster? Why do I have to find things like this? Because now we're getting to a huge gluttony of people having issues here. Now, they do have good customer service. I will give you that. They're responding to everything. Uh, I have no issues pairing. So, can you do it? I'm giving it a check minus. It it's it's just if you're gonna, it's really going to depend on the price for me, Alana, because every single one of those projects had quite a few people complaining about quite a lot of quality control issues, and you're promising the moon, and those two things don't go hand in hand well together so check minus on that they put stuff out but i'm, I'm questionable power up your 2022 work smart play hard five types distraction alerts productivity tracking four levels four levels focus skills i don't okay these these are cool selling points if i understood them a little bit better product productivity insight achieve more with less effort why work hard when you can work smart and play hard? Take advantage of an unparalleled productivity tool with a best-in-class focus skill training to give yourself the extraordinary edge in career and grades. Ditch the primitive time tracker and whatnots. Other productivity tools' capacity to track your performance dulls in the face of Foki. Start draw unprecedented insight of how you work. Start draw. Start draw. What? That's that didn't sound right. Start draw unprecedented insight of how. You, I don't know what that means. Um, <laughs> don't stay in the dark. Get to know every focus, calm, distraction, stress, fatigue while you work. Find out when and why you lose focus or see how well you do today. And now we're picking up steam. All that sounded hot. But this is a Jalopterop right here. They pretty much just have a short video. They splice it all up and that's all we're going to see with some extra uh, tidbits of information smattered in here. But I I'm looking at it logistically. Do I want it? I do. I still do want it. Even because most people are not going to go check your track record. Most people are going to see four created and they'll be like, okay, they've done things before. They're fine. Um, but, but I do. So, but do I want it? I still think you did a great job marketing to it. Uh, even though I do think the video is a bit fast. Can you do it? Don't feel comfortable. How much is it? And that's the big thing. I need to know the price. Get me down to the price. If it's $80 versus $160, those are two very different prices here. You know, I'm much more likely to take a flyer on an $80 one than as opposed to $160. Don't stay in the dark. Get to know. Blah, blah, blah. Things from the video. Earn awesome productivity reports. When moments weren't recorded, it's lost. Track your work sessions. View detailed productivity stars on your working patterns to understand how you focus and record your triumph. Uh, okay. 
And now we're now we're getting now it really does sound like we're promising way too much. Why waste your time on unproductive work when you are already fatigued? Cut short waste with timely nudges. Customize five types of distraction vibrations to stay productive. Now that is actually really stinking cool. Gain a laser sharp focus with biofeedback training. Why are smart people so focused? Take the shortcut. Upgrade to a first class because they use this. Is that what you're trying to apply? Uh, I don't know. Why, learn to control your focus while you work things skill up to stay ahead yeah this is all just you regurgitating the video Ooh, actually what is this what is this this is actually something different and something that i think probably should have been uh spotlighted in the video is the fact that you could do like a community imagine if you had your whole family hooked up to this uh and i think that was real and honestly you know kickstarter is a place where a lot of people have a lot of disposable income and so I think you should be really kind of swinging for the fences here and maybe marketing this potentially more as a big whale family sort of device. Like, hey, this is going to give you and your family, you're going to be able to do a challenge to see who's the most focused. It's going to be a whole fun thing. You can you can monitor heart rates during football games or soccer games or during board games or like you can be like, like you can now make jokes during game night and be like, let me check the pressure on my son. Does, like that's, I think that's a good way to potentially sell this. And I don't think you did that with that video. I think that's something that they might want to, uh, do in the future because you know if you can sell six of them that's that's way better than selling one that's just numbers and this i don't think was really mentioned in the video this looks really cool get motivated and motivate like-minded people start or join a study session with people who want to get focused see how well you stand amongst others and motivate each other the red dot winner what does that mean hmm. well red dot winner 2021 let's go check that out red dot winner 2021 jurors award Whoa, this looks hot. Uh, trends and outlooks. This website uses cookies. All right, I'm out. All right, cool. It, it's legit, though. That's all. I, I just wanted to do a little bit of a due diligence check there. Award-winning design at your way. Smart is the new sexy, but we have both the brain and beauty. Certified by jury of top designers in the world. Foci is a beautiful addition to your waistline. Click back this project. Select award and pledge. So ready to back. So there, and here's, I hate this. Now. I will eat my words if there is a huge chunk of people who are new to Kickstarter for this. But otherwise, I just think having the pledge levels is just the cleanest and most concise way to do it. And this is this looks like a jalop fingerprints all over the damn thing. And let's check it out. So they do. They have a decent chunk, but still the overwhelming majority is Kickstarter backers. That's roughly five to one. You know, so I think having just your standard pledge levels as well would be great. Now, hopefully we... Nope, because we don't. We don't just have the standard pledge levels. If you're going to make me go over here, that's annoying, especially if you're on mobile, because that's just a whole other click you have to make. You're going to have to go to a whole other screen, and if you don't have reception, that's just bad. Um, so pledge levels, I would love to see higher on this product. Just get in, get out, take my money. I love the idea you're pitching, but the longer time, the more time I spend on your, your Kickstarter, the more I actually read the things out loud that you are saying, the less I'm like, okay, this is, this, this is looking kind of weird. <laughs> Uh, upgrade design, sleeker, better grip, more comfort, a whole different beast. Fockeye 2 gains 2.5 times performance. Fockeye 2 would command the second generation. So what you're talking about now is the Fockeye 1 and why we need to get the Fockeye 2. And I think that's potentially something we should have led with. You know, well, actually, I don't know. Because do you want people to go back and look at the reviews of the Fockeye 1? That's, so let's go check out the Amazon Fockeye 1 reviews uh nope it's not on there okay never mind then uh so i just think it's interesting that they didn't spotlight hey we've already done twenty thousand units of the fuck i won and we've been at the at it for four more years and we've done this and we've done that i feel like that might have been a potentially better way to go but then again if they did that maybe that means people would look more into their backstory which i don't think they want you to do i don't think they want you going through the comment section of the previous projects um what people say about fuck i want so now we are getting into this part and it seems odd that it would be this slowed down i am 20 i am 19 minutes into this project and i'm just now learning about the fact that the 18,000 backers from oh and indiegogo so most of them were from indiegogo and then 2299 were from here and i wonder and maybe we'll save that for the end of this after i give a grade i'm gonna go check that out after i give a grade to check out the fuck i won indiegogo and see what their comment section looks like and by the way if you'd ever like me to check out an indiegogo project let me know i never actually go to indiegogo i go to GameFound. i go to republic now maybe i should take a couple trips to indiegogo so this is a bunch of pictures of people supposedly taking pictures of their fuck these all look so fake 
So many of these look fake. What are these supposed to be? Are these supposed to represent the different people? Get your mind back to the... Oh, wow. So four stars on CNET. Wow. Okay. Okay. I see you. CNET Bakai review. That's what up. Look at that. Okay. And that... See, once again, this is what I'm saying. I feel like this should have been led with. Like, this is... Uh, from the four-star original Fockeye 1, we're excited to unleash the Fockeye 2 onto the universe with, with, with just all these different amazing things. I think that could have been a narrative weaved into the video that would have been much more effective than just you showing off cool things about it and doing it super duper fast. And, and like that, I can't help and not notice that. Like that, should, Let me know what you think about that. I think this could have been pitched in, a, in an entirely different way because honestly, that video... It got me intrigued, but it was just, it didn't, it didn't have the oomph. I was starting, I was startled the first time it buzzed with the digital nudge to get me back on track. Yes, I was daydreaming. Oh, these are great quotes. Fast, intervention, you can stop this distraction cycle immediately. Uh, okay. Thank you for keeping us focused. Mo Rocca? From CBS News? Are you kidding me? If Mo Rocca from CBS News said this about your product, and it said even it was on air, if it was on Twitter, I feel like that is the kind of thing that I need to see spotlighted. I did not know nearly enough about the pedigree that you have, question mark, um, because once again, I cannot see all the comment section on every single product back there where, where a lot of people are having a litany of different problems. Now, I know when you make a lot of products, you're going to have that, but that seemed like a, a lot. All right, uh, Tobias Hoffmeister, Professional Productivity Coast, stuff. What do, I, what do I want? I want the price. Do I actually have a pledge? Do you even have a pledge area? Do I have to go over here? You're forcing me to go over here. This is uh, this is the I One launched on June 18th. They added stuff. It looks super cool and impressive. Shipping out I Two 2022. So this is this is a pre-order. This is a straight up pre-order. The Kickstarter launch, the shipping out. What's the future of productivity tech hold? Once you receive your Fockeye, what is this? Hi friends, this is Mick, and this is my folks. You can see I wasn't doing great at it. Deep work is my f Okay, cool. First time I've actually seen a human behind this product. I like that. We'd love your support. Hi friends, this is Mick and Chan. Fuck, I started off four years ago with the mission. Where's the price? Hey, here's the price. We finally have the reward tier. So they did include a reward tier. Why is it at the bottom? This is one of the most important pieces of information that your Kickstarter backers are going to need. $79. That's... I don't even think twice about that product. That should be on the front page. You remember remember that main image where I was like, I don't know what this thing is. I'm intrigued. I see $79. I say, holy crap, I might actually be able to afford whatever this crazy smart work device wearable thing is. And, and I think, because this was in the top four on popularity uh, when I actually looked at it first. Now it's at 17th. It's falling in popularity. And I see why. There's no reason to come back to this project after you backed it. Uh, I may, but maybe maybe it's the updates. But I'm just I'm doubtful based on my track record with tech products. Seventy nine dollars. <throat> so what do we got? That's that's a great price. And they also have all the different currencies. That's super nice. Also, I need the shipping information unless the shipping information happens to be in here. Oh, wait, what? What? No. No, 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 stop it. Stop it, Kick Booster. Stop being so damn shady. So this is the main pledge level, right? No, well, those, so this is... Oh. Oh, this isn't the Kickstarter deal. This is... Okay, so this is already gone. This is already gone. Then get rid of those. If I can't... I thought there was $79. Now it's $99. And now I'm like, eh, not as good. But still, uh, get rid of that. Don't just, just smack me in the face with it. So I was going to say, so 13 backers have actually backed this at the Kickstarter price. And then we have the Start Buddy Pack. What's the Start Buddy Pack? What what what? What is the Study Buddy Pack? Oh, that's when you get more than one? Oh, that's when you get two. Okay, I can read. And this is why I think pictures are good. I think pictures would be really solid right here. This is a, this is a very bland area. Even though I will say I love the, the conversion of the currency. That is super user-friendly. So 70 people, that makes sense. I could see a lot of couples getting down on that. You know, if you had disposable income, get would say, yeah, I'm getting one for my boyfriend or girlfriend. I think that'd be cool. Study group pack. This is the family pack, four devices, six of them. 
six people took that and then we have the super early birds and this is okay this is where we're going to see 1700 people and that's the big initial boom that makes sense especially if you're a uh, kick booster so if you're sharing this kick booster like you say hey if you back this thing in the first blah 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 it's going to be 79 dollars. it's going to go up to 99 dollars. this thing's going to sell out super fast people snatch that up super duper quick because they don't want to miss out on it fear of missing out sort of thing and so that's why kick booster works it really does uh it's just, I, I, I've yet to see a Kick Booster product that just absolutely wowed me. So the numbers look good. Uh, Kick Booster, working great here. <laughs> I will say that. So a review, what is this? This is stuff that I, I need shipping. Let me, let's see. Do they actually include the shipping in here? Maybe, maybe. Bueller, no. So, oh, no, they did. Amazing. So what is the shipping? Excellent, excellent, excellent. Do they have shipping information on the VAT and other information? No. So that is a half point grade drop right there in my book. If you're anywhere outside the United States, you're like, uh, WTF is, is VAT, is, is, is all that stuff. Or does it say it in here? Fockeye is the latest and greatest UK VAT added to shipping fee. Does that, does that mean that the shipping fee is already included? Is that what it means? Oh my God, $45. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what that, <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what that means. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, so $10, $10 shipping to the United States. That is not choose shit what is it free wait what am i missing here is, the, is it free shipping to the united states of america because once again if that is the case that is that is this that is oh my god it's, damn it i full point grade drop there i i am not judging the product here i am judging the the kickstarter presentation and i always need to remember that and this has free shipping to the united states of america in the only way i found that out was by going to the pledge level and then actually shipping and at that point like you've already got the sale the sale's been made they're there so i feel like not mentioning that in the main image seven like 99 dollars kickstarter exclusive free united states shipping like this is such valuable information that could have been conveyed and it's not and like that like that's on that's on jalop i think like just you like it'd be like if it was a minis game and i just found out at the very end oh there's minis in it too and you're like oh shoot this is a minis game you know what i mean so let's check out the faq oh my gosh hate the faq uh i always check and say check out reload from colossal games i think that's the best way to organize faqs uh you put just check it out it's fantastic i've seen some other companies do it uh, but, 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 but this, cause let's be honest, if this is my question right here, I have to read through every single one of these to get to that. How does Focky work? What's the science? Okay. What attraction learns? Okay. It, it does look like it has a lot of information, but just organization would be way better. User friendliness, grasping the intuition of peak mental performance. Dear backers, with our newest software update 20, we received quite a number of messages on the new biofeedback training. Understanding the end can often help us master the means much more easily. Getting the big picture of flow, peak mental performance, could help us grasp the intuition of biofeedback training. Let's briefly skip the part about why flow, as we can easily see how much progress we made and how we were feeling when we hatch flow orbs in the emotion record. In a nutshell, getting into flow requires one to be able to balance the sympathetic with parasympathetics. In other words, you need to maintain a delicate balance of your tension level. Too much tension, we get frustrated, and too little, we lose attention and drop out. Foci's biofeedback training is about assimilatizing to a real-time audio feedback that uses a mixture of technology, machine learning, control engineering, etc., to help you stay in the optimal tension level. Yerxus Dodson. There are a few factors that correlate with flow state, such as having clear goals, immediate feedback, and suitable level of challenge. You can easily make the links from your experience and with an abstraction above to form a deeper intuition what i don't think I, this is so like what i don't even know what's going on <laughs> some more folk i do but able to spread the word of folk uh show the kicks i didn't want uh, i didn't get it to work what to do it's ai generated audio plus dynamic breathing pace wait what uh on your physiological probe is current what if i find the audio difficult to follow can I get a more technical explanation of how Falkeye's feedback... Are there some practical advice? This is such an odd update section, and no one <clears throat> no one commented on it. So that's going to keep you falling down to the popularity. They have not 
We haven't set, posted anything in a week, which is it is what it is. And then what do we got? We are trending number one in popularity of all projects. And this is what I was talking about right here. That's Kick Booster right there. That's Kick Booster. You get people who are trying to make money. So they say, this product looks amazing. Go check it out. They have social media followers. They share that. People click on it. They make the cash. And Kick Booster does its job. Unfortunately, I, n I never get paid from Kickbooster because I give you my honest opinion on them, and I do deep, deep searches. Uh, need we need you to help spread the word? Yeah. So no one is engaged with this. Let's see what the first one was. I'm gonna I'm gonna guess this is just people being excited. Uh, thank you, someone, 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 old backers for the suggestion on our accessory, the signal belt. Signal belt was originally designed for ladies to compliment wearing fock eye on dresses. It gains a lot of traction with our male backers, especially because it gives. What? We need you to help spread the word about Fockeye. Oh, so they do have a Facebook, Instagram. I'd love to spread the word. I run a Discord community of over 1K students studying together. We do coding mostly, and it's a very loyal and active community. I'll share this project there. And there you go. That's Kick Booster right there, folks. That's Denny not giving a shit if this works or not. Because, I mean, and I'm not saying that in a negative way. In any way, shape, or form, Denny's going to hustle. Good for Denny. He shares this to that group. That's great. Hi, where can I see the signal belt on longer options? Same question. Was there... So... This is them taking care of the original backers, it looks like, and trying to keep them happy, which is solid. I like to see that. Let's check out the comments. Let's get out of here. I have a few questions about the vice. Can I only work while working? I'm curious about what we'll say if I exercise or when I'm sleeping. Hey, I just upgraded to a group pack this time around. After talking to my friends about this neat little product, can I get them set to separate addresses, including my old backer add-on? Happy to pay for extra shipping if necessary. Okay. But they're in here. They're doing their job. Let's see what the... Uh, ooh, this person. Can other wearables do this and a whole lot... Can, uh, can't other wearables do this and a whole lot else? Unfortunately not. My Spire could track breathing, but they went out of business. Welcome aboard. So that's just someone trolling. Love the idea. Can I sink breathe... Or maybe they're not trolling. They're just legit asking. I shouldn't assume they're trolling. I shouldn't assume the worst. Can I sync breathing data to Google Fit? I don't think so. Thank you at the very moment. But this is good customer service. They're in here. They're responding. That's what I like to see. So, end of the day, final grade for the Foki 2, work smart with the most powerful yada yada. And where I bet it's mostly United States. Uh, no, UK. For, so $45. They didn't care. Awesome. Final grade on this one. Do I want it? Yes, I do. I love wearables. I love the idea of this. I have attention deficit hyper disorder. I get distracted all the time. This is a great type of product for me. I am the target market for this. And I did. I wanted it. And despite the fact... Uh, it took me a while to get there. I, uh, I I do. I feel like they did a good job. I think that's why they're succeeding so well, because they have a really cool product. And despite the fact, I feel like the, the whole buying process and them showing it to me and me understanding what the hell it did wasn't the smoothest. I feel like they did it well. Can you do it? That one I'm giving a check minus to. I went through all the, uh, there are three other projects and every single one of them had quite a lot of people just like, hey, I got issues with this. I got issues with that. This is a weird thing this does. This is a weird thing that it does. And with a product like this that's promising to do a billion different things, you're going to have that. And so that concerns me a little bit. But it's not a huge deal breaker because I've had products like that. I've had tech products where they're a little bit weird, a little bit wonky. But the things they do well, they do really, really well. Which is why I'm holding out hope for this one. But can you do it? I still feel a little bit uncomfortable. How much is it? I don't feel like the price is terrible. $99 with free United States shipping for a wearable? That's 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 very that's I think that that's a great price. And honestly, I don't feel like you're spotlighting that price nearly well enough, which is another issue that I have with this. Cuz was uh cuz you know, cuz here's the thing. Was this a 24-hour deal or was this a this was only for a certain period of time. I feel like really having $79 on that main image could have just driven a lot more people potentially to it because I, I just, I feel like $79 for a wearable. That's a, that's a great, like that is objectively a great price. And then I find out free shipping and then I see all the cool things it can do. I think it's over. Uh, so at the end of the day, what's my final grade for the Focky 2? Great price. Really want the product? They they are they they're showing off a cool product. Can you do it? A little bit concerned. So in the end, I guess I'm gonna give this one a B minus. No, it can't. C C. I think it's a C. I think it's a C. Like I just I have a hard time, you know, understanding how not advertising free shipping. Like that just that just seems like such a no brainer. Free United States shipping. Because once again, the majority of the people back in this. Uh, what was it? There it is. United States. 719. I mean, so that's that's a selling point. 
You know, especially how top tier of shipping is. Not to, uh, I don't know. But let me know what your final grade is for this one. The Fock A2 works smart with the most powerful productivity tech. Surprisingly, I'm still recommending this one. Okay. A kick booster project I'm still recommending. Yeah, we're going to go uh, cool. Awesome. So if you're interested in it, check out the kick booster link down below. But as always, thanks for your time, YouTube. Bye-bye.